All right. Now we're doing Freight Code Camp, JavaScript Algorithms and Data Structures Beta, Learn Form Validation by Building a Calorie Counter, Step 58. All right. So do you remember that we wrote a function earlier to clean the user's input? Yes, we do. Right there. All right. Well, I could have highlighted it better. Whatever. Uh, so we're going to need to use that function here. So we'll update our curval declaration to be the result of calling clean input string with list at i dot value. All right. So what it wants us to do is get this. All right. So we're going to pass this thing here, this uh, value. So it'll be like like if it comes in e like 10 at e, it's going to clean it up. No, excuse me, 10 e at 10 e 12, I guess. Was that what the, we did here? No, 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 no. If it, if it comes in with pluses, minuses or spaces, it's going to clean it up and uh, just turn them into like, you know, numbers without any of that stuff. Not numbers. It's a string. OK, 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 OK. So it's going to come in and uh, uh, take all the spaces out, all the pluses and all the minuses of a string. Like if we put entry drop down, it'll take this out. And uh, that's what's going to go. OK, cool. And that's what we're doing here. We're going to do that. And then we'll take this clean input string, copy that, and we'll just drop it off right in front of this. Right. So that's what's going on here. So let's check the code. Looks good and submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 59 and we'll see you next time.